<laughs> ah, it's Slimer. Oh, wow, my God. Hello, everybody. It's uh, Dow's Vintage Toys Saturday walkthrough. Walk through the store. And, uh, yeah, Slimer is uh, middle of eating uh, some hacky sacks and some food. So, let's see, uh, see what we got here. He's sitting on top of a... Uh, Sit on top of the uh, tower rack with some Marvel Universe and DC figures. A really cool assortment of uh, all kinds of toys and action figures. More DC over here. The other side, some uh, Toy Biz Marvel Legends. Some really good ones here, some heavy hitters. <clears throat> and if, if you look over to the right, we got a vast collection of vintage toys. These all the box vehicles. We'll take a look at those as we go by. Then here's some uh, vintage He-Man. Some modern He-Man. We got some of the Origins. We got a few of the Origins figures in there. Got the Battle Bones. Got an Origins Battle Cat back there. The little Super 7 Reaction Battle Cat with He-Man. Got some uh, the Super 7 Filmation ones. Or is that Mattel? Excuse me. Did you see these? Oh, what? <laughs> Whoa, we've got Morrison, we've got Bandai with the tags. Can you believe it? Oh my god! We were talking about Ultraman earlier. These are representations of Shin Ultraman. Yeah. That film isn't even out yet. Oh, not yet, and we have the little figure of it. Sorry to crash your video. I just got so okay. excited. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, man. Thank you, Ryan. Thank yeah. you. Godzilla's an Ultraman. Look at that little blue, uh, little blue uh, Ghidorah. I love, well, blue's my favorite color, and I want that. I want that. There's some, a uh, couple of, uh, Motu Classics back here from Princess of Power. A couple more here. We still got the, we still got the, uh, sought after, uh, Motu Classics Faker. It's not the Super 7 version, it's the, the Mattel version. But it's still a good looking figure. <laughs> Little track offs by Loyal Subjects. I like that one. <clears throat> Here's some more vintage stuff we got. William Booz, you are you have the power. Yes, you do. So Centurion, some Ninja Turtles. We got Ground Chuck. We got Wing Nut, and uh, was, it, was it Walkabout? I think it's Walkabout. Yeah. More vintage turtles. Vintage Ninja Turtles. Can't speak today. Jumbo Leonardo, Super Playset. A few more figures, just just hanging around, just chilling. Got the Technodrome. It's a Technodrome. Oh, oh, it's the uh, oh, it's the, the foreign version. Okay, Tortoise Ninja Technodrome. That's cool. <laughs> I never noticed the box until now. So G1 Transformers. Got Superion Combiner right there. Voltron. What are you doing there? More G1 Transformers on the second shelf here. Second to the bottom. Plenty more. Got some GoBots here. A little bit of Ghostbusters. A little bit of mask right there on the bottom left. GI Joe vehicles. Bunch of GI Joe vehicles. Get some, uh, some Tiger Force here. Tiger Force there. <clears throat> Get some. Uh, G.I. Joe boxed vehicles up here. See if I, like the last video where I almost had an incident. Uh, Cobra Night Raven. Uh, the Cobra Bug in the box. The Phantom X-19 Stealth Fighter in the box. Ooh! Come on down, D uh, Dallas Vintage Toys. We have them. G.I. Joe Cobra Battle Game. That kid is having so much fun. Anybody... Everybody would have that exact same face if you played. Ha ha ha. Just put this out here. The uh, Power of the Force 2 Millennium Falcon. Electronic Millennium Falcon. Excuse me. So it's still in the box. It's heavy. It should be complete. The Marvel Legends Nano Gauntlet. This one where you can articulate the fingers and stuff. Got the Ninja Turtles tricycle. Ninja Turtles uh, collector case. Hey. What's up, man? How's it going? Good, how are you? <laughs> Good. Just doing a little Saturday walkthrough video, looking at some toys. <laughs> Got some uh, yeah, Voltron. This dude is, this dude's from G.I. It's so weird to, to know that this dude's from G.I. Joe. 
It's so crazy. Some more Joes here. I got a red Voltron. Red Voltron line. So just, just chilling. Just chilling. Some more Joes. Like some. This is some. Of, we have some of the 25th anniversary Joes in here. We got a bat, Storm Shadow, barbecue, and then the uh, the mass crossover of Matt Tracker. Got some Bill and Ted. Excellent. Then in with the phone booth. Some more miscellaneous figures over here. Got some DC. Some Indiana Jones figures right there. Batman. Batmobile. Little die cast. Batman animated series vehicles of like the Batwing, the Batmobile, the Batboat, Bat Cycle. Bat everything. <clears throat> more Joe vehicles on the bottom. Random little section of the uh, Battle Beasts. Look at that. Pretty nice. Man and Machine, Power Extreme, William Booth. Thank you. Yes, yes. <laughs> Vintage Star Wars here. We got a Japanese C-3PO. Loose Vintage Star Wars. Yeah. Japanese Archer D2. More Vintage Star Wars. Got Luke Skywalker and the Stormtroopers here. Get some Star Wars vintage costume and mask boxes. We have a Sith here. Whoa. You got any moves? He walks away. Oh my god. That's his. That's his. That's some. Uh, Loose vintage showers. Scott put these to, or Scott set these up. Excuse me, can't speak today. Set them up beautifully. They were, they were much more full. They just people been buying them up. So come on, Dallas, come to Dallas for vintage toys, and we'll sell them to you. Got a few Star Wars Legos. They got the Black Series Jabba the Hutt. Yes, a little vintage collection Cara Dune. Dark Miles in the back. A little vintage collection. Uh, oh my god. Oh my god, can't think of his name right now. I'm a brain fart right now. Help me. Dangar. Dangar. <laughs> Vintage Star Trek, Mego, Evil Knievel, Little Remote Control Godzilla. That one's cool. Some more stuff back here. Superman with no symbol on his chest. What happened to it? Rage Cage Hulk. Got some, uh, got that Clash of the Titan figures right there. Some more Migos. More here, okay. Now, as you turn around, <clears throat> as you turn around, got some. I got a Star Wars end cap here. Starts out with little Baby Yoda, aka the Child, aka. Grogu, <laughs> my mind is like not right today. Some more Star Wars helmets. A little bit of Power Rangers here. So this kind of like a little mix of random, random toys here on this little end cap here. As you go to the side, more helmets, some Star Wars Legos, like a Yoda Lego, R2-D2, Mos Eisley Cantina. Got some Furby. Got some, anybody want some Furby? Remember those dudes? <laughs> Death Star Lego set, some gizmos. <clears throat> and if you go down, bunch of Lego sets. A ton of Lego sets. We do have many, many more on our website, DallasVintageToys.com. And if you go around, <clears throat> this is all just like the modern G.I. Joe stuff. Vehicles, vehicle sets. Really, really good stuff. We got some really good stuff. This one's cool. This is one of my favorites. This is a good set. Star Trek. I don't know. 
<clears throat> black series a couple of black series stars over here and on this end cap on the other end there's some uh star or loose star wars vintage collection figures and sent a little bit of mix of of marvel universe figures got some uh little star wars uh die cast vehicles the little black series line they don't make those and they don't, or they don't make these anymore but uh we got a bunch of them on the very bottom here and here's some uh, modern Transformers. Got some uh, modern Diaclone sets. Really good Diaclone sets. Bunch of more modern Transformers here. Yeah, yeah. On the end cap here. Got a really good selection of the uh, Headmaster Titans Return re-releases. Where they look like the G1 packaging. They're really neat. I like that. This is really nice. This is exactly how the original packaging was back in the day. <clears throat> Anybody want a Cyclonus? <laughs> I do that every. I've been doing that every video. Cyclonus. I will do that until he's gone. Got some, uh, yeah, more Kingdoms figures and some Earthrise, some Siege figures. Got some Unleashed figures. I remember seeing those at Target when the first movie in 2007 came out. It was nuts. If you keep going, oh look, oh look, he, he's he's just everywhere. He likes to jump around and try to be in every video I'm doing. Vintage collection, Star Wars vehicles, legacy collection ones, Saga. Really good stuff. If you turn around, look at that, more Star Wars. Just can't get enough of Star Wars. Bunch of the Power of the Force 2 vehicles sets this one's great the battle of endor look at that sometimes when we get these in the little rubber bands that hold them in place are always like rotten off or they just get a snap and they're just rattling inside the box no this one's perfect it's in really good shape alejandro there's always some nice stuff there thank you sir thank you so much how much are you asking for that tmnt tricycle uh, I can't look at it right now. It's, I think it's, it should be posted on the website. Um, more, more modern Star Wars vehicles, box vehicles and sets. Got a little Black Series uh, do back with the Sand Trooper. <clears throat> Come around here. In cap, we got some. Star Wars Micro Machines Action Fleet sets. These are these have been selling pretty good. We actually had we actually had like a lot more. It was a bigger stack and a bunch more behind them. But yeah, these are these are really neat. More Star Wars, more Star Wars. We had the bigger Micro Machine uh, sets right here. These are really big, really big in person. The video doesn't do it justice. <laughs> Come around here. It's pretty much the last of our Star Wars section of the of like like this. So more just if you're a Star Wars fan, come to Dallas Vintage Toys and we have a lot. We have a lot. A lot of Star Wars. I don't think we have enough. But yeah, continuing on to Star Wars. If you walk past the uh, awesome arcade room with the black light, makes it all dark and dark and shiny at the same time. Walk past the arcades. Here's some uh, uh, more Star Wars, and it's all the Black Series, Vintage Collection, Power of the Force 2, Episode 1. Big sets. We still got this the speeder bike, Scout Trooper, and the Child from The Mandalorian. These are really cool. And there's the original Black Series, Scout Trooper on the bike. <coughs> speeder bike, excuse me. Many more, more Black Series. Let me get the here. Look, here's a there's a Remnant Trooper, Bo Katan, we got the Mandalorian, Sean, Lewis, Sean. Mandalorian, the, the Carbonite version, Beskar armor, regular armor, just many more characters from here. here we got the Carbonite Boba Fett, the Christmas color, I call it the Christmas color, it's all shiny and green. But yeah, just many more, many, many more. Let's just continue while we're down here. 
some more AEWs as Ryan mentioned in the previous video. We got a bunch of more AEW figures that the uh, Legends of Lucha Libre. Some Rocky figures. Just a mix of other figures down here. Some NECA, some horror NECA figures, horror action sci-fi. Then we come on down to the Motu. Motu Origins and some of the uh, 2003 cartoon, a few classics here. And there's your turn. Just a mix of other stuff. Like Pacific Rim, like some Bandai, Dragon Ball Super figures, <clears throat> Saint Seiya, Overwatch, Dragon Ball Stars. A few anime figures and Final Fantasy figures. Voltron. I remember having that Voltron toy. I remember watching that Voltron series. It came out in the early, I think it was early 2000s or late 90s. More DC figures, some of, the, some of the Mattel and DC Direct figures, DC collectibles. As you keep going, it turns into the McFarlane Multiverse. McFarlane Multiverse is our biggest section of the DC right now. Because, you know, they're basically hot figures. They're the newer DC stuff. DC is in. <clears throat> Excuse me. More Power Ranger figures and Legacy and Lightning Collection. We got this one right here. Might have more from Metallic Pink Ranger. I think that's Cat, isn't it? If anyone can correct me in the comments, that'd be great. If I'm wrong. <laughs> G.I. Joe. Spider-Man. X-Man. Turning into... It turns into Marvel Legends. There's some more Star Wars up here. Some, some of the stuff gets moved around up here. Yeah. Bunch of Marvel Legends here. If you're a Marvel Legends fan... Come to Dallas Vintage Toys. And as you turn over, you see a couple of our cases. Say hi, Aaron. Hello, everyone. Hello. <laughs> what you got going on? What kind of contraption you got doing, going on? I'm just doing some Marvel Legends that we're, I'm putting up. Um, sorting them? Yep, sorting them out, yeah. placing them. Putting them on display for you guys to come and buy. <laughs> Anytime you see those look nice, because of this guy right here, yes, always sir. makes him look nice. I like <laughs> Put the Batmans oh, with the Batmans, down. Superman with the Superman, Spider Man yeah, with the Spider Man. <laughs> we, we got Iron Heart. Iron Heart. Oh, yeah. The, 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 yes. the newer yeah. female Iron Man. Yeah. 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 What was her name? Is that one right there in your right left hand? Uh, Twistar, I think. Oh. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we got Lady Deathstrike. Lady Deathstrike. Ooh. Ooh, we got a Taskmaster. Right, Taskmaster. Oh, Anybody watch the Black Widow movie? <laughs> cool Iron Man. Cool. Uh, He's in the raft set. <laughs> Got white. The white. Uh, why can't we think of any names yeah, so right now? Name. Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> mine, but mine for you. <laughs> Brain fart. <laughs> can't think Nova? Of Nova. We know Nova. Yep. Ooh, we got a green Iron Man. Optimus Prime. Yep. Optimus, Optimus Prime. Optimus yeah. Prime. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Come on by. Yeah, come on by, everybody. So, and sell us, if you have Marvel Legends, sell it to us. Because we need some Marvel Legends. We need more Marvel Legends. Box Transformers. Yeah, yeah. Box Transformers. Will J. Rev Brandt says, any Caradoon? Yeah, we have uh, some Black Series Caradoon. Let's go over. What's up, man? What's up, dude? How's it going? We have a loose uh, credit collection uh, Caradoon. We have a couple of the uh, Black Series in box Caradoon. Then we have uh, this one over here. Got the boxed one of the credit collection Caradoon. That one's pretty cool. <clears throat> so, yeah, so it's back over here. Actually, let's get back over here. Here's some more mix of other stuff. We got the Power Dome from Power Rangers. Japanese Power Ranger Megazord sets. Miscellaneous uh, vehicle sets from other toys, other toy lines. We got some Jurassic Park 3 figures. And this one sold as a set. 
sold as set. I forgot to put an A next to it. Sold as a set. Excuse me. That was me. Yeah, these combine. These two weapons combine into a uh, bigger weapon. <laughs> yeah, back over here. Here's some uh, next to the N64 games and Nintendo games with some loose modern Transformers. NECA horror or Mortal Kombat figures? Yes. Let's go see. So when it comes to the Mortal Kombat figures, we got a couple of lines from them. We have some of the, uh, all we got left is the, um, when it comes to the McFarlane, we just got Liu Kang and Shao Kahn at the moment. I think we have Sub-Zero, don't we? No, oh no, we got a Baraka. We got a regular Baraka. Yeah, just Liu Kang and Shao Kahn at the moment. Yeah, we do. And uh, over here, I adjusted the Storm Collectible section like I said I would in yesterday's video. Aha! Storm Collectibles, yeah, here's the here's the Mortal Kombat. Here's, we got some Motaro. And then over here, and over here, we got some more of the uh, heavy hitter Mortal Kombat. The heavy hitters Mortal Kombat figures of Rain. Uh, Human Smoke, Noob Cybot, Classic Scorpion, Bloody Goro, two, ver two of the UMK3 Scorpion, and two Ermax. And, uh, yeah, that's it for the Mortal Kombat. And for the horror, for the horror figures, we have them all mostly over here. The NECA horror. Right here, some Chucky, Gremlins, It, Friday the 13th, Predator, Aliens, Halloween... Alien. See, we got we got a mix of Godzilla and King Kong. Got some of the NECA Terminator Dark Fate figures. We got a we got a Guillermo del Toro figure. Anybody need a Guillermo del Toro? <laughs> Pennywise or Pennywise? We got we got Starlight from the Boys. Mix down here. We got the NECA three pack of Halloween three of the Trick or Treat of the of the three kids. <clears throat> the uh, Aliens uh, USCM Arsenal Accessory Set. We got plenty of those. We got Elvis. We're out Elvis. Come to Dallas, come to Dallas with his toys. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. <clears throat> and we got the questions. Uh, Abigail Reed says, or excuse me, asks, what Barbies do you have? We have all kinds of Barbies. Let's start off with this. <clears throat> Barbie, we got the Barbie Let's Drive set. We got two of these like jumbo size like Barbies. Giant Barbies, really big. They go up to my stomach. <laughs> Pretty big. And here is the Barbie section. We recently bought up to a thousand Barbies last week. And Dina got all these organized. She's really good at organizing the Barbie section. She is the best. Oh my god, indeed, Abigail. <laughs> yeah, a lot. While we're still on the Barbies, let's go over here. Let me show you this section. As you walk over here, past the shirts, $15 each. Wednesday is 10% off if you wear them. If we go over here, some more Barbies. These are some of the... Uh, so these are some of the more higher valued Barbies. And we got some in the back case over here. Got some I Love Lucy ones on the very top up here. Big selection of Barbies. So yeah, that's it of the Barbies, so. <clears throat> Alejandro Perez. Abigail, <laughs> yep. Do you have Wheeled Warriors? I don't think we do. Check our website, DallasVintageToys.com. We may have some, but I have not seen any in a while. So, let's go on to Castle Grayskull. Let's check out the graded stuff. The graded stuff that we have. We got some uh, graded Star Wars, carded graded Star Wars figures. So many. 
And on the top of here, the USS flag. It's ginormous. It's huge. But yeah, it is uh it is for sale. It's massive. Look at that. Massive. Look at that. It's like a scenery. I'm putting the camera on it. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Asked about the Will of the Warriors, you can say that we're complaining about seven or eight of them. Oh, really? And then we're going to be putting those on the website probably soon. Okay, update. We do have some World Warriors that we're trying to complete, and they will be on the website soon. Thank you, Sean. <clears throat> it's a blue screened Star Trek figures. We got a Decide from, I think that's from the, it's from the Superpowers line. Yes. <clears throat> Mad Balls, created Mad Balls. The OG Mad Balls. These are really cool. I like this one. Uh, what was his name? Fist Face. That one's cool. It's like holding an eye, but it's like a fist. It's so cool. I like that one. It's got some graded uh, Masters of the Universe 2002, the 2003 cartoon figures. Of Merman. They got Skeletor. And Tila. You got some graded He-Man figures right here. I've got a bunch of web stores and Orcos, some Catras. Got we got Jitsu, more Princess of Power figures. Got a store display down there. Scratch on my back. <clears throat> and if you turn around, you see some strawberry shortcake. Yeah, and a sealed shipper case. Of 48 figures inside. Some ma a graded mask vehicles. Got a buzzard, a couple more, a couple more buzzards, and some Indiana Jones, graded Indiana Jones. A bunch of more mask vehicles. We got the <clears throat> all right, we got the bullet, the buzzard, the iguana. The Firefly, the Manta, Meteor, Goliath. If you go over here, got more Goliaths. Graded Ninja Turtles. Hey, someone uh, make them face forward. They look better this way. They actually look really nice. <laughs> they look really good. <clears throat> Here's some Joes, some carded Joes. Some characters from the first from the first wave down the later wave got a bunch more these are really cool return here Let's get some more Star Wars power of the force with the with the coin more with the coin it's, uh, who is that? I can't read it from here. Okay. I have like Roomba. Roomba. Not Roomba. Roomba. Some Jedi boxed uh, play sets, vehicles. Got a Rancor down here. Boxed Rancor. Never open. Return of the Jedi carded. If we look up here, we got the uh, Sideshow Han and Carbonite. Some more jet a couple of random drill vehicles up here, and we have the really massive Legacy uh, Legacy Millennium Falcon. Really massive, and it has lights and sounds, and you can open up on the inside. There's so much detail. It's insane, and it does shoot missiles, but I think this one is missing. This one is missing a couple of missiles. Missing missiles. <clears throat> so we got some more uh, Star Wars. Vehicles. <clears throat> yeah, see here. Some transformers. Look at that. Millennium Falcon spaceship. And uh, we move over here. Loose graded Star Wars. Hey Trevor, come have fun with us. Why? 
Okay. But yeah, you those guys, we gotta, gotta end it here. So uh, thank you all for watching. You can check us out on YouTube and Instagram and Facebook. And uh, yeah, check us out, guys. Thank y'all so much for watching.